Um, my name is Sedu. I've been attending the program since yesterday. Uh, today is day two. And I really believe that this is a good forum for all of us to catch up. Uh, if you look at it, we've got all sorts of people here. We've got the English uh, speaking group, we've got the Chinese speaking group, the Tamil speaking group and the Bahasa speaking group. So this conference actually brings together, it's conference kita, so it's about us. So in Malaysia, if you look at this conference, it's actually bringing us together, harmoniously together. And we've gone through a lot of things since yesterday and the interaction is really, really good, you know. It allows us to learn from one another. Each one has got different experiences in life and everyone is of a different age group. So you have very refreshing ideas coming in both from the elderly and the youngsters. So you're able to interact with one another and in that interaction, we learn a lot of new things. So we've been talking about building vibrant communities and I suppose the exercises carried out yesterday uh, brings out a lot of new ideas and new ways that we can move forward in bringing both materialistic as well as spiritual development. Children's program, the junior youth program and youth programs are more critical because they are going to be the future. So we need to encourage them, get them involved and make them grow. As they are growing, they will come out and make the community a lot better than what it is right now. Russian, I want to share a song that I learned from day by day. And then again, little by little, day by day. And they can make the world a better place. Day by day. Building a vibrant community, in my opinion, is actually you know understanding each other from different stakeholders' perspectives. Like for example, I'm I'm a conservationist, right? And you know you have to understand what the problem is before you get to fix it. And you can just kind of go in there and just say, hey, I know what I'm doing. You need to take a consultative approach, and that's what I learned. So far, on the first day of the conference, I've been so amazed by the participation of the participants. They've been so engaged. They have so much to contribute. Yeah, yeah, that's. That's very true. I think it's interesting how to see the dynamics of these two different age groups. You know, the the youth and the you know the old. I wouldn't say the older generation, but you know those uh, much senior citizens coming and reflecting. And I think one thing for sure, we are really learning how to consult. Hi, my name is Dimple. I'm 11 years old, uh, and I have a lot of fun. I learn about thankfulness. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very glad to be at this uh, Baha'i conference. Uh, I'm a mother of two. My children are age six and five. And through this particular Baha'i conference, I've learned that the purpose of education is not just for material well-being. You know, do well in school uh, and uh, and have a job. It's not just that. I think I learned through this conference the importance of spiritual education and availing spiritual education to my children and also the, the children out there. Would you like to wave to our friends on online? They are online friends. Online friends, please wave back. <laughs> yeah, Daniel, I see Daniel as well. And the nice thing about this conference is everyone's having a good time. It's a conference where we are mingling, we are talking, we are interacting. And it's a fun gathering, but at the same time, we're still doing something serious and worthwhile. So I think the good thing about this is it brings us together, bonds us as a family, which eventually will help the community around us. In this shape, in this size, we can
this material. I need builders to help build it right now. I have this one. Dulu saya memang saya segan untuk mencekak depan orang. Tapi semalam saya sudah join sini konferen. Saya sudah berani sekarang untuk boleh cekak depan orang, boleh naik pentas. Saya sangat gembira. This program is all about teamwork and bringing people together. I think for teenager like me, I think I'm very lucky because. I've I hope that there will be more of these conferences in future to raise the awareness that we all play a role, especially parents, we all play a role in building a vibrant community for our children and for the future generation to come.